welcome back. Uh, today we're going to have a little bit of ghetto living instead of ghetto cooking. Uh, what do you guys see here? Most of you probably see three pair of tube socks and two bags. You know what I see here? I see a pair of ghetto mittens and ghetto boots. Yeah, today we got snow on the ground. Back then, we didn't have no fancy boots. All you had was a pair of tennis shoes and a pair of dress shoes. And boy, if you got those dress shoes dirty, or you got those dress shoes wet out playing around, you better hope that police come and take you to jail before Mama got home. Anyways, well, I'm going to show you guys how we used to do this, how we used to make these into a pair of ghetto boots and a pair of ghetto mittens, and that way we could go outside with the other neighborhood kids and play. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, here we go. <coughs> You're getting ready to go out and play. You didn't have time. Yeah, that's right. I got my house shoes on. This is a ghetto experience. I'm going to show you how you make a ghetto boot. Take off my good socks here. Put them aside. First thing you do, put your first pair of tube socks on. Okay? There you go. I'm going to roll up my jeans so you guys can see this well. Okay. Now, you put on your bag. Back then we had, we didn't have bags like this, but what we used were bread wrappers. We saved all those. There you go. Now, you put another pair of socks on over that. What the theory behind this is that you got a dry pair of socks, then you have your vapor barrier, then this pair would have absorbed the moisture. Okay? Another thing we do back in the ghetto, we had a long underwear like I got on now. That was your pajamas. You put your pajamas on and you put your pants over it. Now put your shoes on. And there you go. You got yourself a pair of ghetto boots. Just like that too. That way you won't get your pant legs wet. Now, for the ghetto mitten, all you gotta do is open and insert your hands. There you go. Now you can put plastic bags inside here too if you want. If your hands get cold too easy and wet, there you go. We're ready to make some snowballs, have some fun guys. <laughs> 